Hi guys, today we're going to be taking on Laura, who loves to play like Judith Pollard, her idol, uh, expect some aggressive tactics and try to hang on. All right, so 1100 challenge match, black or white. Okay, so against an aggressive player, let's go with D4. Let's try and slow things down. Uh, D4 openings tend to be a little bit more positional. So let's try and get developed and not let Laura run us over. If we can get out the opening, guys, we'll be fine against this aggressive player. So in the Queen's Gambit, it's good to put the bishop here to have some long-term vision with the queen on this square here if they have a castle kingside. So this looks to challenge our, our pawn here. So it's always good to take towards the center, but then they'll reinforce with the pawn in the center. We could also look to close things down here. What if they push on our knight? Looks a little bit annoying, but I think we're going to have a nice strong center here. And I don't know how they're going to undermine it now. Because they've not got any pawns that they can actually push here to, to try and chip away. I guess they could push here and chip away that way, but we can actually, we've can actually we got that reinforced already. So we've got a nice, nice position. Uh, so let's just develop the knight naturally. And uh, yeah, see, Laura's supposed to be aggressive. Um, we've we've done a good job here of closing off her attack because what's this bishop going to do? I don't see any aggression. And that looks aggressive, but we've got this kicking the queen out. We've done this before, guys. Let's kick the queen. And now what? Where's your, Where's all your aggression, Laura? So now it's good to create a loft move for the king, but also we've got to answer what are we going to do with our dark square bishop. So we've got this square sufficiently defended. So we're castled, right? We're ready to go. We're ready to attack. Maybe just one more move looking to, to reinforce. I mean, we can throw this move in, hitting the queen. I don't see why not. So now maybe a move to allow that, because that would trap the queen. So say here, to allow this. So let's just subtly slide this move in, guys. Hopefully Laura doesn't see it. Yeah, and look at that, isn't the queen just trapped? Yeah. So we stifled Laura there. All our pawns were locked in. We had, we had a nice little triangle into the center. We got castled. Um, we brought our rook to the potentially open file. We're going to open it up now. Uh, so let's trade off the pieces, guys. We're up a queen. Why didn't they take back? What? I don't think this is fair to 1100, guys. I think most of you 1100s would have seen that. Uh... Yeah, they should have obviously taken the knight with the king there. A uh, bit flummoxed, but... So we can do this, bring in the, bring in the uh, bishop. Finally getting some activity for this bishop, because that was our, our problem piece. Uh, so we, we like the fact this rook is open. So let's double the rooks. And just have some pressure on the king. Uh, so, do we care about this pawn? What about check? They can't even take it with the with the pawn. They could take it with the bishop. What about this first? Hmm. But if here, 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 this looks quite snazzy. Probably not great. But, well, we love looking at locking our bishop in. Okay, so now this can be taken with the pawn. Um, what if we pin this bishop? Maybe we could create some mischief, guys. So we've got this pawn. Let's take that for a start. And, I mean, we wanted to play this move anyway, guys. This is mate. <laughs> you shouldn't... You shouldn't force your opponent to play moves which lead to them mating you. Or lead to them improving their position. 
Uh, so that's how you beat Laura. Uh, she's supposedly aggressive, but we what we did, we closed the game down with our pawns, so there wasn't any open lines for her to attack us on. And then we... Yeah, we, we just won the queen. The queen got trapped on this nasty diagonal. We saw that we could trap it. We did a move of preparation with the queen and then got the bishop and rammed it down the queen's throat. So that was nice. Uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Subscribe and join the Discord if you want to participate in our uh, weekly tournament subscriber battles. Cheers. See you next time.